Welcome to our video on how to super fast your laptop and PC. Is your laptop running slow and driving you crazy? Don't worry, we've got you covered. In this video, we'll share some simple and easy ways to boost your laptop's performance. Now let's get started. First of all, we are going to remove temporary files from our PC. These temporary files are stored on two locations. So the first one in Windows folder. To open temporary files in Windows folder, first of all, open Run app on your laptop. For that simply head over to the search tab and type run. Now click on run app. Now simply type temp, temp, click on ok. Now we are on temp folder. The temp folder is used by many applications on our laptop or PC. These applications leave temporary files left over here, so we need to remove those files. Once we delete these temp files, it will help to boost our Windows PC performance. So now simply select all files, you can press Ctrl and a key on your keyboard to select all files. Now click on delete or simply press Ctrl and D key on your keyboard to delete all files. Click on continue. Now you can see some files can't be deleted because these files are in use. So simply select do this for all current items. Click on skip. You can get this type pop up a few times. Simply do the same that we did before. Now here you can see some temp files because we are running some programs on our PC. To remove all temp files simply close all programs on your PC. And then do the same steps that we did before. And then you can delete all temp files on your PC. Now I will show you the second location, where temporary files are saved. For that, simply search percentage temp percentage. Now open this folder. This is another location for temporary files. Most programs will create temporary files here. That's why it take more space on our PC and temporary files slow down our computer and make it difficult to work sometimes. It can even be hard to perform basic operations. So it is good to remove temporary files from our PC. Now simply select all files. You can press control and a key on your keyboard to select all files. Now click on delete or simply press control and D key on your keyboard to delete all files. Now you can see some files can't be deleted because these files are in use. So simply select do this for all current items. Click on skip. Now here you can see some temp files left over because we are running some programs on our PC. To remove all temp files simply close all programs on your PC and then do the same steps that we did before and then you can delete all temp files on your PC. Now I will show you how to remove all junk files from your Windows laptop and PC. To speed up your laptop's performance, for that simply, open Run app on your laptop. For that simply head over to the search tab and type Run. Now click on Run app. Now simply type Prefetch. Click on OK. Click on Continue. Now we are on Prefetch folder. These Prefetch files are created by the operating system each time an app is launched for the first time. These files are designed to make apps open faster and don't use too much disk space. But if you feel that your PC runs very slow because of lots of prefetch files stored in your device, then you can delete them without causing any problems. Once you delete prefetch files, it will speed up your laptop in most cases. So now simply select all files. You can press Ctrl and a key on your keyboard to select all files. Now click on delete or simply press Ctrl and D key on your keyboard to delete all files. Now you can see some files can't be deleted because these files are in use. So simply select do this for all current items. Click on skip. Now here you can see some prefetch files because we are running some programs on our PC. To remove all prefetch files simply close all programs on your PC. And then do the same steps that we did before. And then you can delete all prefetch files on your PC. Now I will show you how to clear RAM cache from your Windows laptop and PC to reduce lag on your PC. For that simply, open Task Manager. If you don't know how to open Task Manager, then simply search here, Task Manager, and click on Task Manager. If you see this type of screen, then simply click on More Details. Now click on Performance, and click on Memory. Now here you can see the cached. Right now we have this much RAM cached, so if we clear this RAM cached, our laptop performance will boost. So let's clear the RAM cache on our laptop. First of all open any web browser, and search for RAM map download. Now click on this link, don't worry, 
This is the official download link for Microsoft Windows laptops and PCs. Click on Download RAM Map. Now the file is downloading on our laptop. Once the file is downloaded, simply click on it and then click on Show in Folder. Now simply right click on the zipped file and then click on Extract All. Click on Extract. Now simply head over to RAM Map. Make sure you select this one only, now right click on it, and click on Run as Administrator. Click on Accept. Now we will get this type of small RAM map application box. Now I will show you, how this RAM map clears the RAM cache from our Windows laptop and PC. Simply click on Empty tab. Then click on Empty Stand by List. Once I click on it, we can see our RAM cached clear from our laptop. Here you can see RAM COD reduced, and this helps to boost performance on our Windows laptop and PC. Now I will show you, how to free up disk space on our Windows laptop using CleanMGR method. CleanMGR is used to clear unnecessary files from our computer's hard disk. Its purpose is to free up disk space on our hard drive. Now first of all, open Run App on your laptop. For that simply head over to the Search tab and type Run. Now click on Run App. Now simply type clean MGR, click on OK. Make sure you select C drive where the operating system is installed. Click on OK. Now select all files. Once you select all files, you can see here, the total amount of disk space you're going to clean. Now simply click on OK. Click on delete files. That's all for now. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more tech tips. Thanks for watching.